Hello everyone, welcome back to Ton Time. This is your host Donnie, and today I will be unboxing this awesome uh, Asus ROG Strix Arion. This is an M2 NVMe SSD enclosure uh, with Type C USB. It's using USB 3.2 Gen 2. So this is the device. Pretty much, you put your M2 stick in here, and it's like having an external hard drive when you hook it on or if you need a flash, um, an OS, or uh, Linux, or whatever operating system on the drive, on another PC, you could use this as well. That's what I'm gonna do. I actually run a couple of mining machines and I need to flash an M2 stick um, with the Linux-based operating system, so that's why I bought this. So, um, it came shipped with this nice uh, sleeve or this uh, white plastic bag, so I'll go ahead and Open it up, and it's a little bit tight, so it'll tight but a little bit strong. So, so this is what the retail package looks like. Beautiful, colorful graphics, nice shiny outline of the product on this uh, printing of the box. This is the side of the box. This is the back. This is the other side. Front, as you always seen. Top and bottom. So that's the retail packaging. Very beautiful. And also, have, you could use the Aurora Sync if you want. There's a light on there as well. This won the CES 2020 Innovation Awards. And this also comes with a USB A to USB C or USB C to USB C cable, which costs, I think, five or six more dollars. They also sell one that doesn't come with any cables if you have them. So, um, and I think it's just a little bit cheaper. I just opted in and got one with the cable since I don't have that many USB-C cables at the moment yep so I will go ahead and open this up looks like there's two sides here so let me grab my knife okay two stickers sealed on the side has a little tab that looks like you could pull out. So you get this foam enclosure and the product. The enclosure unit is here. Oh wow, it's pretty pretty heavy, made of aluminum. So nice and heavy. This is the instruction. So there's a little key here that pops out. You open up the enclosure, screw your M2 stick down, and then pretty much pop it back in. And underneath here, looks like you also have a little strap. If you want to put on your keychain or carry it around with you. So, this is the. There's another thing in here. Let me try to get it out. It's kind of stuck in there. Okay, this is like a nut, like a rubber protector bumper if you want to carry it around put it around there and then here's the two cables USB A to USB C and USB C to USB C you got your quick installation manual so this is how you would install your SSD pretty straightforward Gigabit 
per second of speed. Then this is just like your safety information in multiple languages. And this is your user manual in multiple languages. So yeah, that's pretty much everything in the box here. So, so you get the actual unit, the actual unit, the, the carry all rubber enclosure if you want to carry it around, two cables, strap. So, so that's everything you see here. So let's go ahead and open up what the unit looks like. So it's all metal, it's pretty heavy, which is cool, I like that. And then you can see that this is where things will light up. I think it lights up up there and here. And there's a USB-C connection on the bottom. It, everything is powered by that one connection, so there's no other external power. And then this is the little key. Don't lose this. You'll need this to pretty much unlock it by pushing this in here. And that pretty much unlocks the bottom. And as you can see here, there's some thermal pads here to keep, help cool. This case is aluminum, so it'll help dissipate the heat of your drive. So there's thermal padding for for the stick itself. And then here it says, please initialize your new bank message before using it. You may refer to user manual for more information. So this is the chip design inside. So you would pretty much plug in your M2 drive in here and then screw it down. And if depending on what size you have, there's other slots here if you have a shorter stick that you can use. So it's pretty cool. I like the design. It's a little pricey than others, but I think uh, you get what you pay for. There's a really nice design. There's a thermal pad too, to help dissipate the heat, which is always a plus. So I have a, this is the M2 stick that I'll be using for now to flash over, but just so you guys can see, so this is one of the M2 sticks that I will be flashing and pretty much you just angle it in, push it in, and then, um, I, don't, I don't have a tool on me, but you would unscrew that and then keep it down. So, so yeah, that's pretty much the whole, the whole case here. I'm gonna go ahead and pop it back in. So it looks like you would put the hinges in first here since there's a piloting hinge there and then you just pretty much close it and then you're done. You should be able to plug it in, format it, and you should be good to go. And if you wanna have your case protected on the go, if you wanna take it with you to gaming land parties or whatnot you could pop this on it so this is what it looks like with 
the rubber bumper so like if it ever falls down there's some shock shock absorption to it so it should protect this case fairly well and you can always use this to hook it on I think it where how does this hook on or does it hook on top here Oh, you know what? Sorry. Duh, my bad. This is actually, uh, it goes on the other way. So you probably hook it up here since it's the longest. There you go. So it's just a Velcro strap. And then you would hook this onto your belt or whatever, your keys or whatever. So I was doing it the wrong way. So that's pretty much everything combined here. Pretty solid product. You're definitely getting what you pay for. So there you have it guys, this is the ASUS Republic of Gainer M2 NVMe SSD enclosure. Thank you for watching, it's a beautiful product. And that's pretty much everything you get here. And don't forget, the key is very important, don't lose that key, which is right here. Keep that in a safe place so you could open that and replace it whenever you want. Thank you for watching. This has been a Tontime video. Until next time, peace out and have a good day. Thanks everyone.